Okay, so day one, leg three, we start off from Peaceful Bay, going through the uh, hinterland on that four-wheel drive track, and we pop out of the mouth of the inlet here. Great views and what have you, we're heading inland uh, to find a river crossing. So, uh, yeah, nice to get on the track and underway. And then at about the six kilometre mark, we get to the Irwin Inlet and the river mouth that we've got to get across. So there are canoes here provided by the Bibbulmun Track Foundation and uh, that's what you'll be using to get across the other side. So it runners must paddle yourselves, either two in a boat or one in a boat, depending upon how many people you get, you're here with, uh, across to the other side. I reckon it's about 200 metres and then we keep on going. There will be a, a race official here to assist you and they will have responsibility for bringing the canoes back. So we'll ensure there's always boats here ready for arrive, runners to arrive and a paddle across. But, uh, I'd look forward to this. It's a good bit of adventure and a way of uh, breaking up your run. <laughs> so here's the other side of the river crossing. We finished down there. We started over there. And now we've got more uh, just nice flowing trail through the, uh, the hinterland, the heathland here. Views to uh, Irwin Inlet on the left and in through the, uh, the dune country. So the trail after the river crossing it's really nice, this sort of open glade, open sand dune country, hinterland country. It's nice running on a double track, firm underfoot, but continual undulations going up and down, up and down. I'm walking most of the climbs and running the descents and the flat bits. Uh, yeah, but it's nice open country, I'm enjoying it. Bit of a, bit of a change from being on the coast and yeah, good kilometres. Then we hit the beach. So nice. Untouched. No footprints. No four-wheel drives. Just more wild running. Sand feels pretty firm. Waves to watch. Could be anywhere. Sometimes you just gotta stop running and stop and enjoy the view. Check this out. Just dropping into Back Beach, deep into uh, leg three here, day one. Sun's come out. I know where I would rather be. Nowhere, right here is the spot. This is magical running. Well, I'm at the 17 or 18K mark here, leg three, and yeah, it's gonna be tough actually. There's some uh, undulating single track. Once you leave the second beach, might be Back Beach or Middle Quorum Beach, I think it might be called. Uh, yeah, it's an undulating track. Not super sandy, but short, sharp hills. Yeah, it's uh, starting to uh, dig a little deeper. Still nice going though. Just look at this place, would you? Spectacular. Had to stop again to take in the views. All right, day two, leg three. Spectacular, so good. A real journey from uh, the hinterland, the flat tracks near, um, was it Peaceful Bay? And uh, over the river crossing. Second half got harder. Second half undulations on the single track on and off the beach, a bit sandier. So uh, yeah, a beautiful run, a really beautiful run. I'd say a little bit harder than leg two, but uh, you're not missing out by doing this one or otherwise. It's, they're, they're all world-class runs and um, yeah, look at this place. This is Boat Harbour, this is uh, checkpoint three. So um, you know, one more leg to go on day one. How good is it? <laughs>